Some of you are asking, what is optic nerve hypoplasia? Well, I'm going to attempt to do my skin routine very quickly. Um, and we're going to talk about it. All right. So optic nerve hypoplasia is basically where my optic nerves are underdeveloped. Because my optic nerves are underdeveloped, my optic nerves are the size of a sewing thread. But there are different degrees of optic nerve hypoplasia. Some people with my condition, their optic nerves are more developed. But others with the condition, like me, are less. Some people with this condition are totally blind. By the way, the products I'm using, I will do another video on them or you will have seen them because when I was doing my face routine on YouTube, I edited it here on TikTok, so. Alright, so basically, um, mine are more developed and my friend Alyssa, well, I'll have her tell hers later, but yeah. Okay. But basically, optic nerve hypoplasia is where your optic nerves are not developed at all. Or if they are developed, it, it's... <laughs> yeah. It's not much. Um, okay. Okay. So... Um, basically, um, the, um, degree at which it's undeveloped varies person to person. Okay, um, so, yeah. Um, it varies person to person, and it's not the same. So, um, mine, as I said, are a quarter of the size they're supposed to be, but not everybody is the same. So, some people are total, which means they can't see anything at all, and other people, like myself, can see light colors and shadows. I'm trying to hurry because my phone's at 10%. I'm just going to grab one out. Oh well, I'll grab a stack of them. So what? Um, but, yeah. Um, some people are total. Some people are not. I am not total, but um, it depends on the severity of your condition. So, as I've said, some people are more severe, some people are less severe. It all depends. So, um, it depends, as I've said. Okay. So... Um, because my hair was there, my hair has oils in it, I have to go back over. Okay. So basically, um, this, um, this means that, um, I guess you could say it's a spectrum in itself. Yes, blindness is a spectrum, but it's not that widely known as a spectrum. Um, it's a spectrum, yes, but blindness is also a spectrum. Um, if you watch other blind creators, you will hear that 
a lot from said creators talking about blindness being a spectrum. So, as I said, yes, blindness is a spectrum, but so is optic nerve hypoplasia. Oh, this is not the best smelling toner out there. Oh, it's burning. Oh, okay. So, this is my Clear Proof Mary Kay toner. Um. Um, but yeah, as I was saying, it's a spectrum in itself, and, um, just, so is blindness. Um, <clears throat> blindness is a spectrum. Optic nerve hypoplasia is a spectrum. Um, all of this is a spectrum I'm fanning myself, just so you know. Um, just, yeah, there's a lot of different differences when it comes to blindness. Um, this is not wanting to come out. Okay, there we go. Okay. It's not going to work, so I'm just going to have to do with what I got. I don't want to have to mix serums, but I guess I'm going to have to today. Because, okay, there we go. Okay, so I got a little more serum. So, um, optic nerve hypoplasia, you know, it is not... Of big disease like it's not a condition that is widely known and that's why not many people know about it and I'm having to use a lot more serum than the average person because of I have a big face so um, yeah so uh, I got my hair okay, I got it I got it I got it I got it, I got it. but yeah um, Alright, so I've finished my serum. Camera died, so that's why I had to finish it early, but that's okay. So, today I'm not feeling the St. Ives, so I'm going to use this moisturizer right here. This is by HERS. Um, this is a good moisturizer for if you just don't want a St. Ives moisturizer that's scented. Um, this is a runnier formula. And it is a little bit lighter weight, actually, than the St. Ives. Yes, I'm going down my neck with this. Don't play with me. Okay, just do not play with me right now. Because you don't want to play with me right now. But optic nerve hypoplasia is a spectrum eye condition. Some people with it are cane users. Others... Or not. I myself am a cane user. So, um, yeah, my freaking moisturizer got in my freaking hair nice. So I'm rubbing it in even on my air, neck, and chest. Because you can't do that with a facial moisturizer. Okay, so I'm just going to rub this in and all this good stuff. Um, I forgot how runny this was because it's been a good while since I've used it. Um, I'll use this when I'm not feeling the St. Ives formula. Alright, and I'm just going to let that sit. And I'm going to grab out my ice globes, I think, depending on how I'm feeling. Ow. My freaking, I got a plastic cut on my finger from trying to open something and yeah, it hurts like a, mm -mm. 
Um, but I'm okay. So I'm going to grab my ice clothes if I can find them. Um, but yeah, it is a spectrum. Um, there are actually different severities of it. Um, in a way of, not in the way you're thinking, okay? But I'm talking like in a way of, um, <laughs> crap. Um, excuse me. Like, <laughs> excuse me. I can't explain, like, there's total blindness, large print reading, and then there's regular, um, like, light colors and shadows, or light and dark colors, light. In all color, it depends on the person with optic nerve hypoplasia. But, um, I'm not gonna use my ice globes after all, because apparently, oh my god. Guys, I am peeling. Oh my god, I had so much dead skin on my face. No wonder. Holy frick. Oh my god, and I'm not wiping my moisturizer off, guys. I'm wiping this dead skin off of my face. Ah, oh, that is crazy. I, I did not know I had all that on my face. No wonder I was broken out. <laughs> But, um, so, yeah, um, it's a spectrum. I'm not sure what else to say about optic nerve hypoplasia, but, um, I myself was born with it, and I think, yeah, I think you, yeah, you do have to, I know for a fact, anyway, you do have to be born with this eye condition. You can't, uh, you know, lose development over time, so... Uh, you do have to be born with it. Um, but yeah, I hope this video was helpful. And I hope you enjoyed me being a total buffoon. And uh, putting my skin routine on a uh, on my face. And finding freaking dead skin. And having a cut on my finger and trying to do my freaking face routine. Now my finger hurts. Um, so I'm going to go probably cry. <laughs> Because my finger hurts. And I will see you in the next one. Peace.